Welcome to the Average Rook. We are playing Goodbye Deponia. We're back to the tutorial again. Actually, we're not back to the tutorial again because I want to skip it. Bye. So as we left off... My fellow Elysium, I know how much you have been looking forward to this day. Regrettably, however, I must inform you that Inspector Cletus and his companion have not yet returned. Therefore, we cannot yet exclude the remote possibility that down on Deponia, part of the population have somehow managed to survive among the junk to this day. Prime Controller Ulysses has confirmed that the Organon is ready to fulfill its mission. As soon as the inspection team give the all clear on the return from the ruins of Portofisco, nothing will stand in the way of the spectacular start of our journey to Utopia. It is only a matter of hours until we can finally give the Organon the signal to go ahead and blow up our home planet. The good news is, due to this delay, the water slide will stay open for now. So as we left off, we hit Deponia again. It's gonna be a long time before we get to Elysium. Take us away, Jan. So this is the third strike, you're dumping me just like a trash bag. Why? Just because of some must tart on the carpet, you pathetic dog head. I assume that you're humored to just bite the dust. But this isn't over yet. Here you can bet on that. The last part of my day will surely appease and change your mind anyhow. So turn on your death aid now. The story goes on for good things come in threes. Huzzah, good things come in threes. Okay, hopefully this is going to be very interesting because I partially forget what happened during Goodbye Deponia. So as we left off, we tried to, uh... Well, we tried to stop the Lady Gull from escaping with Cletus. And we blew up the Organon Fort, and we're back on Deponia. In the midst of, Jonic. I think, some battle? Jonic. Hey, wait a minute. Smoke! What? Fire! Good morning, ladies. Stop! The fire extinguisher! I'll wake those and get the mine detector. Take it easy. I'm just making breakfast here. Fried sludge with honey. Oh, not again. <sighs> the allergy medication is in the cupboard with a bear trap. Nonsense! The sludge is just the base. I'm not hearing any of the music I now. am fishing at this very moment. I'm using the diving crane to catch something big. Oh, goody. That's a new one. Uh, no problem. Let me think. We should be in the Sea of Shards by now. Do the we have enough that? The Sea of left? Shards? Um, Doc? Yes? This isn't the Sea of Shards. What? Oh, right. I forgot to tell you. I hatched a great plan while you were asleep. Oh, God. What, what could that be? Done? I found an abandoned on-ramp for the Organon's monorail track. And so I thought to myself, Bozo's Cutter used to be a rail vehicle, right? Right, first. What? You steered us onto an Organon cruiser route. Yeah, and it'll take us directly to the Upper Ascension Station in Port of Fisco. Where the Organon's headquarters are. And where the last high boat to Elysium is anchored. That was the plan, wasn't it? I will use my amazing resemblance to Cletus to sneak on board, together with gold. But... So come on, let's eat something first. <laughs> That's the diving What exactly train. are you trying I've to catch? i got a bite. I thought we weren't on the water anymore. So what? What do you mean, so what? So what took the bait? Uh-oh. You freaking idiot. You destroyed Bozo's cruiser. Okay, I literally cannot hear a thing. Excuse me while I fix some options. Okay, I think we are ready now. Can't use navigation, we might as well go on deck and see what we've caught. Oh, crap. 
I guess this means Bozo will finally accept the fact that he needs a new cutter. Oh, Rufus, you were so right. You are such a good friend. You are a gigantic <laughs> it's his own dick. fault. <laughs> what a lard bag. Okay, where has Go gone to? Let's go to the prowl. This shaking is uh -oh. very disconcerting. What's kept you, Argus? I uh, was just talking to the Elysian Council of Elders. They're starting to get nervous. That We're on our way, Prime Controller. Inspector Cletus and his companion are on board. There will be no further delays. I should very much hope so. Ulysses, over. Uh. Treason! Stop the engines, Argus! Cletus, you have no business here. You're supposed to stay in the cabin until we reach Port of Visco. That will have to wait. This woman is not my fiance. Put his eyeballs in the waffle iron! I know that. She's a Deponian with a brain implant, which also happens to contain the cartridge with the mind of your fiancé. No, it doesn't. Do you think this sounds like gold? Chew flesh from their ankles! Rotten vinegar and... Maybe she's about to have, um, uh, you know, a visit from Aunt Flo. Rubbish. That Rufus pulled a fast one on me. We need to turn back. Oh, uh, yeah, you I forgot fool. that, uh, Excuse me, Bainish, sir. The There's something on the track. What do I care? Run it over. We have no time to lose. The inspector has forgotten something important, and he's in trouble if he can't find it soon. Open boss, you will go with Inspector Cletus. As you wish, Bailiff. Interesting. Okay, so what the hell? Uh, Stern Bridge? Uh, Stern. Phew! Goal! Goal! Hang on, I'm coming! Best that you don't. To the side wall. Signal up and what? Hi. Okay. Still nothing I can collect in this area. Uh, let's see. So there's a crane fitting. This goal. Let's just talk to goal. Goal. What the heck are you doing? I'm trying to free the cable. Please get off there. It's dangerous. And here I was thinking you don't even know that word. Sure I do. Danger is my middle name. Actually, I meant please. But if you want to help, the crane is awfully wobbly. You need to tighten the screws. Oh, all right. No problem. Okay, but. By tightening, we're just going to be loosening, right? The crane might break at any moment. I need to do something. Anything. You've chosen a romantic location. Well, you refused to go to the theater. Yeah, at least the seats would have been more comfortable. For starters, you might want to tighten the screws. Yeah. In the meantime, I'll try to free the cable. Consider it done. Yes, but well, we're not actually going to be uh, tightening them. We're going to be loosening them, of course. All right. Uh, middle screw? Huh? That's hey. not... Left screw. Uh... Oops! Is this exactly what's gonna happen? This is exactly what's gonna happen. We have no concept. And this is just gonna... Watch this. Any progress? Well, uh, yeah, there is some, uh, progress, uh, so to speak. Everyone's going to die. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> uh, what have you done? Wasn't me. Damn it, Rufus, we're going to fall. No, we won't. I'm slipping. No problem, I gotcha. Okay, hold on to go. Oh, jeez. Uh, ah! Rufus. Well, well, who have we here? Uh, who the hell are you? Uh, that's Rufus, of course. Don't you know anything? Uh, and who are you? Oh, uh, just a fan. Don't pay any attention to me. A what? A fan? Exactly. Just carry on, will you? But uh, just a teeny tiny question first. How are you going to get rid of him? How? Uh, what? You know, what spectacular Rufus maneuver are you going to use? Oh, that. Uh... Uh, let's see. Um... I'll confuse him with my blackout tactics. 
I'll confuse him with my blackout tactics. Ah, a residual. Meanwhile, Gull is just spinning in infinity. Highest level. Blackout? You're bluffing. Perhaps I am. Perhaps I definitely am. I'll, I'll, I'll switch on my night vision just in case. Jesus Christ. There. Done. Do your thing, Rufus. Man, this is going to be so epic. Um, okay. Okay. One. Two. Uh, I'm blind. I'm blind. What? what? That'll work. <laughs> and... Ta-da! Wow! You actually did it! Yeah. Ah, that's me, you know. How on earth did you do that? <laughs> Wait for the photo. And now you're gonna go save Gold, right? Who? Oh, <laughs> her, sure. <laughs> How are you gonna do that? One thing at a time. The two of us should have a talk first. Um, we should? Yeah. Fan to idol. Wow, what an honor. Oh, uh, for the love of God. So, you're a fan of mine. My name is Barry. I traveled for miles only so I could talk to my greatest idol just this once. Well, then let me talk instead of boring me with the story of your empty life. We should use the time for an interview. Uh, really? Shouldn't you be saving gold first? Ah, uh, her. All in good time. A true hero must take care of his fan base. You wow. are an idiot. You really are the greatest. I don't even want to go through this interview. Screw that. How about a little photo session? Oh, fantastic! Hmm, let's see. What would be a suitable subject? I could take a picture of you saving goal. Yeah, but then she would be in the picture too, right? Wouldn't that distract unnecessarily from the protagonist? Quite on the contrary. It would emphasize your selflessness. You think so? Mm. All right, then get ready and uh, make sure my selflessness is clearly visible in the picture. Okay, let us see what we got. We've got a button, a cannon, him, and go. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Let's try this button. What would this button do? It reveals a lever. Ingenious! You found the cruiser's manual oh, speed control! Exactly! The manual uh, thing of me. We're gonna make oh, it go faster, aren't we? I feel another brilliant Rufus maneuver coming up! Shut yeah, up and let us fail, okay? So much noise? Shut up and let us fail. We have to slow the thing down, but unfortunately it's gonna speed up. Are us. you going to start the extreme action now? The what? Well, the action! A super extreme Rufus maneuver! Uh, yeah, exactly. Um, totally extreme. This is so exciting! Are you going to start the- Well, a uh, yeah. Why this do we have to speed it up? Um, I see. You're accelerating the cruiser instead of stopping it like everyone else would have done. That's because everyone else is an idiot. And the cutter being caught in the cogs is part of your plan as well, right? Uh, sure. All right, can we deal with this now? Um, please! See oh, those parts no. fly! <laughs> this is gonna be bad. Um, woohoo! Faster still! This is so rad! My coat is on fire, but I'm still very happy to be part of this. Luckily, the Organon is known for its excellent fire protection measures. Dad, that's just propaganda. I bet my boots. Okay, why the Your hell boots on that. are the sound effects a lot louder than- Excuse me for one second while I modify something. <laughs> Alright, let's just grab this fire axe. Then the hose. Put I out can't Barry. put out his burning coat right now. This hero is busy saving an actual person. Okay, what could we actually use it on? The lever, maybe? A goal? <laughs> yes, she's hot. What about the cannon? We could do a water cannon. This is gonna go horrible. Wait, uh, Cole, I'll shoot you free! But you're a crap shot! <laughs> yeah! Ah! Dang, the cannon's aim is off. Okay, what happens if we do this? Maximum speed already? Yeah, that's the organ on for you. Spoil sports. We seriously... Okay, what about the hose? 
Uh, what? Uh, daredevil. All right, what do we do now? What do we do now? A hose is a hose is a hose. Okay, we've got the fire axe at Hold least. Still. I think it's probably just as well that we don't uh, rely on Rufus' plans anymore. Hero. Even though the game is going to make us. We destroyed... Ah! We destroyed Someone his cruiser. Open. So now we have to walk all the way to the nearest uh, station or whatever. So the cutter struck sails, wrecked Estonia's mum scales, <laughs> and up as much a whale for the long road ahead. Still the mood and the group was just super whoopie doo yeah, except that they slowly grew ripe for the bad. For they knew that they would have to go on by foot, and no problem for such to walk is all the less stressful if you sing along with a motivating song. And to emphasize this, I flap the cabin of the coast guys with helium gas. <laughs> So now we have done the arduous trek to this midway station. Well, now we've made it. Ha! Yeah! And wow! The way I took out that Organon with my shadow attack. Shut the hell up. Did you see that? For the thousandth time, Rufus. That was so cool. They call him Rufus. Rufus. Just push him oh. off the edge. Everybody now. He's cool and he's smart. It's something, something modern art. What? Hey. Where are you going? There's a hotel down there. I really need a wash. Especially for my ears. But, but... Goal? Come on, Rufus. Are, are you mad at me? So Dirty, battered, humiliated. All of that. But mad at you? No. So is she altogether three parts? It was actually kind of cool. You must be lying through your teeth. Oh yeah! Something something modern art! <laughs> okay. So now we just need to get down there, so let's go. Haha! -ha. Stairs! Dark and steep and slippery. Huh. I'd better take a jump. After all, I hate to... You're gonna knock everyone down, aren't you? Nope. You by yourself. Thank goodness for that. Uh, fall on my butt. That would be too embarrassing. Okay. Ooh, what's this? Long hair platypus found. Oh, we've got a secret. Okay, where do we go first? There's this, there's this, there's this, and a toilet door to whatever the heck that is. Let's check out the toilet door first. Soothing music, though. Occupied. Uh, are you ever coming out of there? Don't rush me. Mm. I'm suffering mm. from severe temporal diarrhea. Severe temporal diarrhea? Mm. Temporal diarrhea? Yes. I'm a time traveler. Mm. You mean you come from the future? Nonsense. Oh, hold on. There is no future. I came from the past to watch the end of the world. Ah, uh, here we go again. Then you're It'd be in funny the wrong if this actually place. connected to the guy Devonia who's Doomsday. gonna prevent the end of the world. Oh! Mm. That would be very nice of you. Mm. I'm stuck here, you know. Why? Is your time machine clogged? Not exactly. Mm. There's no more toilet paper. Hey. That was irony. Naturally, I don't believe a word you've said. Well... 
it wasn't exactly the whole truth. Ha! Huh, I knew it. There's hmm, one roll of toilet paper left, but it's as rough as sandpaper. Oh, oh, and I had the chili during the toxic and civil war. Oh. Somehow I'm just gonna label this as toilet humor. All right, let's see what's in here. Okay, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, there's that way, there's that way, wherever that goes. Let's ring the bell. <sighs> My circuits are scrambled. I shouldn't get up so fast. Or get a little exercise. Whoa! Don't creep up on me like that! Creep? I rang the bell! Phew! I thought it was my tinnitus. It wouldn't surprise me, though, with all that noise from the cruiser route, not to mention the cold draft or the mold, but I digress. Welcome to the Hotel Menetekel. Would you like to Menetekel? rent a room? Uh... Uh... Actually, I was just looking for my friends. A geriatric garden gnome, a girly giraffe, and a circus bear in a hat? That's no. them. Yeah, Wait, they what? just checked in. They didn't look like they could afford a lawyer, so I gave them room five. But don't worry. As long as they don't touch any light switches, electrical sockets, or load-bearing architecture, they should survive the night, provided they stay in the room after midnight, of course. Which reminds me. Do you happen to have unfinished business with demons, dark gods, or the recently dead? Not yet. Uh, not that I know of. Super! That's all right, then. You have no idea how squeamish some insurance companies can be when it comes to supernatural causes of death. Here's your key. Please have a pleasant stay here at Hotel Menetekel. Oh, okay. Uh, thank you, uh, my good man. Okay, um... How will I find my room? Oh, probably horrible. I wouldn't want to spend the night in there. Oh, why do I bother? Many Tekel. That's a strange name for a hotel. Yeah. You think so? It's Many Tekel. I've always thought the name was cute. It means something like impending doom. That's what I mean. Who wants to live with impending doom? Don't we all do that? Uh, right, but if you have a choice. But you don't. Or have you seen another hotel around here? Okay. I'm going to my room. Yeah, do that. I won't stop you. And before you ask, that does not constitute an act of negligent bodily harm. No, of course check. not. Okay, we are basically done with you, I suppose. Let's go this way. This is the kitchen, apparently. Let's grab some stuff. Grab a salt shaker. Grabs a pepper shaker. Grab a corkscrew. Can we grab this candle? No, we cannot grab the candle. Can we grab anything else? There's a coffee maker that I technically don't want to trust. And a pitcher. Can we grab the pitcher? I don't think much of modern art, but this is good. It's drawn from the perspective of a person who unsuspectingly opens the urn of his dear departed mother and then dies of a heart attack because of the spring-loaded flowers popping out at him. <laughs> what a pity it's hanging so crooked. Aha! Here, we have the perpetrator. Huh, a nut. Can we grab the Who nut? Who needs tools when he has hands like vice grips? <laughs> Pretty slippery, my vice grips. Do we have anything that can grab it? Not really. Can we put the picture back? No. Let us go this way then. Reception. Uh, okay, it's the same area. Never mind then. Uh, what is this way? Oh, the room areas. Can we grab anything here? Uh, I don't know which one's number five. What happens if we go this way? This is, I don't know, some sort of game. Oh. Ouch. Who needs change when he's got magic fingers? Okay, we get it, it's a pie machine. Ouch. A painful pie machine to be precise. Wow, with a fun slime troll and one out of every five pies. Rad. And all these years, I thought they weren't allowed to make these anymore. Uh, I'm pretty sure they aren't. Um, there's outside to that. There's back to the rooms. I don't necessarily want to play with these just yet. We might do that in the next episode. We're now onto the balcony. What's in the trash bin? You can find the craziest stuff in the trash. Like a pelican. <laughs> Huh, a pelican. That's not crazy. Mildly odd, maybe. What are you... Whatever. Uh, I can't deal with the leak. 
far as I know. Back to the pie vending machine, back to the rooms. Let's go back out and try this. Um, hey, what's going on here? Boom, hum, kumbaya. Uh, okay. Uh, hello, you, uh, <laughs> you Wait. friendly hooded people. Is that who clearly Bozo's belong coat? to a uh, non-violent organization? Um, are you standing in line for the washing machine? Boom, hum, kumbaya. Dooba 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 uh, you wouldn't mind if I, <laughs> if I go first, right? Okay. Act weird once for sure. No problem, pal. Hum, hum, kumbaya. That sounds like a yes. Cool. <laughs> then if if I could just. Uh... Hum, hum, kumbaya. No. no. Darn. I think I see an egg. A woolly platypus. Can I grab Bozo's suit? I can grab Bozo's suit. Can I grab the coat hanger? I can grab the coat hanger. Nice. Can I do anything else? Probably best that I don't talk to this mysterious laundry sect. And that is one horrendous washing machine. Which I don't want to deal with, so I'm going back outside. I didn't want to do that. Let's go to... That's dealt with, dealt with, dealt with. So let's go to the rooms, try and find our people. I'm guessing they're in... Let's try this one. There's nobody here. <laughs> That's nice. Then I can come in. What? No, stop. Too late. Oh. Uh, hello? You there? Under the sheet? There's nobody under the sheet. Don't be silly. I can see you. You're seeing a ghost? Can't be. I don't believe in ghosts. Especially not the creepy sort that hang around in dark hotel rooms and are eternally trapped between worlds until their poor souls finally find release. I'm not a ghost, and it would be a release if you would disappear. Not so hasty. If you aren't a ghost, what are you doing here all by yourself? In the dark, right next to that peephole into the next room. Oh, no. Um, I... Ooh, I am a ghost! Go away, or you will feel my supernatural ghostly strength! Uh -huh. Unless, of course, you're from room service. Uh, I don't have any food, though. I'm already gone. We'll come back later. Uh, wait, why is it into the closet? Well, that's it. Uh, oh, this pressure. What if I fail and the world really does end? Oh, no. Well, I'm glad you got a view of that. Unless the hole goes into the room further I down. I am the greatest. Let's try to do this. Huh? Easy. I hear something. And the destroyer will pass through this door, and he will bear the sign of the beast. I know that voice. That's M. A dull knocking will precede his arrival, and he will say... Ow! Oh, oh, that's gonna, that's leave, gonna a leave a bum. bum. Hey, don't mock me. You... Wait a second. I know you. You're very busy. No. You're the guy with the pipe. The soothsayer from Porta Fisco. No, soothsayer. I'm not. You're a liar. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh, which basically disqualified me from being a soothsayer, doesn't it? Uh, that's just hair splitting. Um. You don't happen to know those guys from the laundry room. I don't know what you're talking about. Well, they're carrying candles, singing in minor keys, and they're wearing the same outfit as you. Well, I wouldn't worry about it. Probably just a harmless glee club. They painted a pentagram on the floor. Ah, circle of fifths. No doubt about it. Ah! Circle of fifths. Okay. Yeah, you're beyond help. We'll go through your dialogue That's later. We Don't have time for this. Need to find our room stat. Let's try this one. Huh. Locked. Goal? No answer. But there's somebody in there. I hear voices. Let's try, uh, this. <laughs> it fits. All right. They were just ignoring us. Ah, 
There you ah. are. And wow, what is all this stuff? Did you just set it up? No. Neurofusion chambers are standard in this hotel. Of course we did. Huh, pretty speedy. And uh, what does one do with a uh, neuro thingy? Can you watch scrambled channels? <coughs> that too. But most importantly, it will repair Gold's brain implant. Brain? You know, remerging the aspects of her character. Yes. You're an her idiot. entire consciousness was stored on a cartridge. Right, together with the ascension codes. That you need to gain access to the high boat. Exactly. After this procedure, Goal will be her old self again. And then you can make use of the shower. Shower? Why? Oh. For the Ascension customs? That'll or did do. you think they'd let you into Elysium like that? What? And just what is that supposed to mean? I'm just saying, considering everything we know about that Cletus, he is an extremely clean person. So, if you want to pretend to be him, shower. Hey, let me deal with that. You take care of Goal, or do I have to help you with that as well? Not necessary. It's almost ready. Cool. Eh, almost? What do you mean, almost? Oh, what do you mean, almost? Oh, uh, nothing bad. I just have to calibrate the data interface. Uh, and once again, I have to do all the heavy lifting, right? N not at all. No problem. I can fillet a data thingy with one hand tied behind my back. You just have to press here. And don't Rufus, press it. No, that throttles the fuel rods. Ah, they can handle it. Uh, Rufus, this calibration is really much too easy for you. Why don't you take care of the much more difficult professional mission? Professional mission? Of course. Doc still needs this thing that can't be found in this hotel I like room. how Bozo oh, has learned how um, to speak to Rufus. Exactly. That, uh, he knows. In order plasma, to convince him, uh, he has to tell him that he has more importance somewhere else. Uh, a mammoth fur. Relay. A plasma exchange whoop de doo mammoth fur relay? Hard to come by. Huh. For beginners like you, maybe. But for a pro like me, it'll only take a jiffy. Yes. Hopefully a jiffy. Unfortunately, a jiffy is not what I have time for right now. Not a lot has actually been done in this episode, but hopefully it will improve because I really do like this series. We have just destroyed or at least separated ourselves from an Organon cruiser. I'm not actually sure if we destroyed it at all. And we reached this way station in the middle of the track. In the next episode, we'll be exploring through that fixing goal and hopefully making our way onto a cruiser where Cletus is so that we can replace him and make our way to Elysium. But that may take a very, very long time. So, thank you so much for stumbling onto one of the most average gaming channels out there. Like and subscribe for more if you enjoyed the video. Check the corresponding playlist assuming something turns up or one of the recommended that pops up below it. I'm the Average Rook, see you soon, and more average content coming your way.